What's up, guys? This is Crux. Um, anyway, <clears throat> excuse me. I've been receiving a lot of messages in my inbox about why I'm not um displaying me opening the packs that I do. Um, and there's several reasons for that, and I'm going to explain why. Number one, I haven't been buying a lot of packs. The cards that I need, like, I've been getting through trades. Um. And then, uh, most of the things in my trade binder I did open up from packs. But, number one, the reason why I'm not videotaping any packs that I do open is because I don't have a camera right now. Um, I have purchased a new one. It is being shipped today. And, um, and, uh, it should be getting, um, to me probably by Wednesday? I don't, I don't know. Um... But, uh, you know, I, I should be getting it soon, um, and that'll be the solving of all our problems. So, uh, yeah, um, it, it's, it, it's gonna be great, um, that camera. Second off, back to the I'm not buying many packs detail. I'm saving up for a box of Dark Ascension for when it comes out. Reason being, I've discovered that you get more Mythics by purchasing from a box rather than wasting my money that I all have in one week buying a bunch of packs. Um, I have a less chance of getting the Mythics because I have less packs. Um, and uh, I'm spending more money and by buying the individual packs and... Um, I have a less chance of getting the Mythics, not only because I have less packs, because the next week it'll be a whole different box, because the other one is sold out, and then, you know, then I have an even less chance. It's, it doesn't circulate. So, um, it doesn't work out. Um, am I saying I'm only going to be buying booster boxes? Hell no. Am I saying I'm done with Innistrad? Heck no. But, as soon as I'm done saving up for this box, I have it all up in an envelope. Um, all, everything that I'm saving. I currently have $95 saved up, which is pretty incredible. Um, but so I have $95 saved up, and, um, and, uh, yeah, I'm, um, pretty excited. I'm hoping to save up probably about 10 more dollars in case of tax. Um, it's really nice, though. The guy up the street, he doesn't typically charge tax, like on packs, he doesn't charge tax, so, um, I don't know what he's gonna do on a booster box, it's definitely a much larger investment, much larger purchase, so we'll probably slap some tax on there, but, um, I don't know, I don't know, so I, I want to be safe, save up another five dollars. As soon as I'm done with that, I have a decision to make, and this will be your decision, do I save up for a Dark Ascension fat pack that I'm going to buy on the same day as, like, the the pre-release as well, or do I, um, do I, uh, just start buying in a strad packs? I would prefer to save up for the Dark Ascension, because it's only $35, um, which, you know, I'll probably make up pretty fast, um, I probably can get like a small job, blah blah blah. Probably sell some of my cards. Uh, hopefully win some packs at FNM with my new um, my new deck that I've been working really long and hard on. Hopefully I'll win some packs off of that, um, which you know would be nice. Um, and then I can probably sell those packs. Um, I will be getting a pack from Mr. Lubafu pretty soon, which will be pretty good. Um, but, anyway guys, um, that's your decision. F fat pack or Innistrad as soon as I'm done saving up the money for Dark Ascension. I will start having pack openings of Innistrad as soon as I'm done with saving up for the box of Dark Ascension, if you decide for me to start opening Innistrad packs again. Um, anyway guys, that's it. Uh, thanks for watching, and uh, peace.